Good morning, my love. We are getting married today. I want you to let that sink in for just a moment and read this next part very slow. I am going to be your husband and you will be my wife. Today is the day that we become one. Dear Adam Benji Dorn, Hello there, my soon-to-be husband. I'm smiling as I write these words to you and imagining you reading them on our wedding day. The thought gives me butterflies and fills me with excitement. As I sit here writing, my thoughts drift back to June 22nd, 2019, the anniversary of our dear friends Elliot and Mackenzie, and also the day you swept me off my feet, literally and figuratively. I still picture you in that red dress with your strawberry blonde hair swaying back and forth as we danced that night. I don't think I ever stopped smiling. I did not believe that it was possible to develop a connection so deep and that it would be so very easy to love someone until I met you. And so we met for breakfast and she was like, sorry, I'm a little tired. I was up until five o'clock in the morning. And I was like, wow, that's a wild wedding. <laughs> she was like, well, I was actually walking around downtown Des Moines with one of the groomsmen. <laughs> and I was like, okay, well, how well do we know this guy? So I was a little skeptical at first of Adam not knowing who he was. And, and following the walk, Adam said to Terry, that was a great first date. And Terry said, that was not a date. <laughs> But as Terry and I talked more in the fall of 2019, I realized that Adam was not messing around. He was pursuing her. Um, and he made her feel loved and recognized in the ways that all of us want to be in a partnership. I promise to be by your side through all of life's challenges. I promise to be there to pick you up when you've been knocked down and I vow that I will always support you in achieving your dreams. Your family is now my family, and I will always love them as my own. I promise to always love you on good days and bad days and all the days in between, through tears and laughter and things we cannot foresee. Much has happened between when we first met, and now I would not change a single thing because it led us to today, right now the day that I have the privilege of marrying my best friend and the love of my life, you. With this moment, your hopes are being fulfilled. This moment is a merging of two paths of life into one, two families into one. This is joy. This is love. This is wonderful. <laughs> Take it all in. <laughs> we will build a home together and fill it with laughter, empathy, faith, music, imagination, trust, friendship, companionship, and love. We will unite in our shared values and they will strengthen us. We will honor our differences and they will enrich us. Let our lives be intertwined forever and our love for each other grow stronger with every passing day. Our commitment to each other binds us together. From this day forward, we are one. Adam, the thing I appreciate most about you is how much you show, how much you care for our daughter. And we are more than thrilled to welcome you into our family today. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's so beautiful. <laughs> you are so beautiful. <laughs> my prayer has always been for all my sons that they would find the right spouse for life. And for you, Adam, God has certainly answered loud and clear her name is Terry. With this ring, I betroth you to me forever. With this ring, I betroth you to me forever. 
I betroth you in righteousness and justice. In love and compassion, set, set me as a seal, seal upon your heart. heart. So on this day of great joy, we pray for you, not that you may be happy ever after, for that cannot be. Rather, we who care for you pray that you be granted a generous measure of blessing. In the years opening up before you, may there be moments like this one, when all who are touched by your life are filled with hope. May those years be kind to you, and may the sweet goodness you already know grow deeper and stronger with the passing of time.